hey, FSD, you need anything before I get to... Didn't I tell you, FSD, you can't mess with the frame arm girls? You're gonna get them dirty. You honestly think I'm scared of that? I built you. I'll unbuild you. Hey, come hey buddy, hey, come on. It's it's Papa Crow. Come on. Come on. We're, we're buddies, right? I mean you ain't gotta go all out like that. Damn, Bill Strike 2? Was it because of the pose video or something? Alright, sorry, I got y'all. I got y'all. And Frame Arms Girl, you ain't getting no pose video. Mm, not on my watch. God damn kids. Alright YouTube, welcome again to another pose video. Uh, so in this edition, we're gonna pretty much um, put this guy into whatever poses we can. Um, now there are some poses that are pretty nifty with this that looks pretty, you know, awesome. However, um, standing poses is extremely difficult. So uh, I might be using the action-based stand, uh, well not an action-based stand, but it's gonna be a, um, it's called a stage one stand. So I'm gonna go ahead and utilize that for uh, most of the poses. Uh, but let's go ahead and just get into the first one. Okay, and here is the first pose. Uh, this is actually the box cover art, which looks really awesome. It's him just firing a Gatling gun, having his big shield out there, not as much really defending himself, just kind of like throwing it out the way, uh, so that way he can shoot his Gatling, but I'm pretty sure right after following up with some uh, shield blocking, because you know they're gonna go ahead and retaliate with uh, their missiles and all their ammunition as well. So I think this looks really awesome. It's kind of him just jumping out of the way, uh, which I think looks really fine. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into the second pose. Okay, and here is the second pose. Um, now, obviously, you, you can see right there with that foot, um, it's not gonna go ahead and bend in any lower, so it's just really problematic. Um, and that's why I kinda like pushed that it, in my review that if you're gonna go ahead and pose this, honestly, you might as well have it just standing up normal, maybe you know with shooting or something like that, um, uh, just standing up, or you're gonna have to put it in the action base. Um, there's really, I mean, this to me looks horrible. Like he, he, I don't know, I just, I don't like that foot just kind of being kind of loose out there because I don't think that'd be realistic at all. Um, so if he was like, you know, trying to slash an enemy or something like that, um, it, you know, I want him to lean a little bit forward. Like I want the kit to lean a little, little bit forward, but it just won't, it, it, it keeps falling over. I have to try and keep finding that sweet spot. And to be honest, I don't have the patience to keep like, fumbling with it as parts keep popping off and and falling off. So it's, I'm not saying this is like a truly just over a top terrible thing, but you are gonna have some struggles when trying to pose it in any kind of uh, pose that's not just standing. Um, so without further ado, let's just go right in to the third and final pose. Okay, here is the third and final pose. Um, now, originally, I was having him firing his uh, machine gun from the hip, but I really just didn't like that. I, I, I thought it looked kind of goofy, and I couldn't get the feet exactly right once I kind of concluded with everything. Um, so instead, I kind of just went with a walking pose. Uh, just, uh, you know, I'm kind of thinking of 8th MS team, and, you know, when they're just kind of walking through the forest or walking through the city, like, that's just the image I had with this mobile suit. I, I, I didn't see this as kind of like something that's going to be slashing and uh, or sliding and all that that craziness. I think he's really just going to be walking and shooting his weapon. Um, so I, I thought like, hey, let's go ahead and reenact something like that as if he is 
uh, truly walking and you know I, I think this kind of looks perfect for this mobile suit um, but that's it guys definitely thanks for watching um, you know these these pose videos uh, are sometimes frustrating like in the case of this one and the uh, star build uh, or uh, build strike cosmos or galaxy cosmos um, those are sometimes frustrating but like uh, mobile suits like the um, Blue Destiny Unit 3, that was actually really, really fun to, uh, to do some pose videos with. So, um, I'm just going to go ahead and conclude with this. Um, you know, this is an okay kit to pose, but you're going to be frustrated much like I was in certain situations. Um, whether it's parts are just kind of like clicking off or you're just not getting that sweet spot. Uh, that's kind of like the issue I had. But that's it, guys. Definitely thanks for watching. Um, you know, if you do enjoy these post videos, let me, let me know in the comments below. Um, and tomorrow I should be working on the Beam Master, the GM3 Beam Master. Now I also have a pose video. Um, so that's it, guys. Definitely thanks for watching. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. And uh, definitely ring that bell for notifications for future reviews. So I'll be seeing y'all in the future reviews. Bye-bye.